being advertised as a one-stop shop for all your medical marijuana needs. The full-service pot store opened in Oakland today. As Julie Watts tells us, they even teach you how to grow plants. Hi, Julie. Hi there, Julia. Yeah, you know, they're calling it the Walmart of weed, but I think a better comparison might be Home Depot because of all that how-to advice or Ikea because of all these elaborate displays. When customers walk in after the grand opening tonight, they're going to see various displays like this that show the nutrient system. This particular medical marijuana growing system uses these wool blocks. Originally, they were designed to grow peppers, but are now being utilized for medical marijuana. Now, around the corner here, uh, there are some more eco-friendly ways to grow your medical marijuana. Uh, those those can't be recycled. So of course, there's the potting soil with the uh, the organics, or there's some more complicated systems. Far too complicated for me to explain. So for that, I've got the expert here, uh, Justin. What is this system behind us here? This is an aeroponic system. It uh, uses water, uh, sprays and jets, and basically you can grow anything in there. There's a reservoir here uh, that pumps the water through the funnels and so sprays it at the roots. Yeah, it's a pretty complicated system here. You have various systems. Now, let's talk a little bit about the legalities. I'm sure people at home are wondering. There is a school nearby, but it's important to know you don't actually sell the marijuana here, and you don't even sell the seeds here, right? That's correct. We don't sell any plant matter at all, not even regular plants. Um, so we do. We are, you know, under all the regular laws making sure we cover that so and what you do do is you basically show people how to build their own growing systems you'll even come out to their house and build it for them but in order to even talk to you they've got to have one of their medical marijuana cards right correct if they if they do want to talk about marijuana we we do require that that's one of the recommendations and you call yourself one-stop shopping because you do have a doctor in-house here who can actually issue those cards if they do have a valid medical reason that's correct all right. So now, normally when big uh, marijuana growing operations open, we hear a lot of backlash from the public. But you guys have actually been getting uh, some substantial support from many notable politicians. There will be two city council members here tonight for the ribbon cutting ceremony. John Garamendi is on your website endorsing this. Why do you think that is? You're getting so much public support. Well, I think Oakland is still in a state of you know positive growth. Um, we bring uh, this company to an area that's not as or typically been as desirable. It's a retail location, so you know it's it's good for the you know the people. We were opening up jobs, so it's just overall good for the area. All right. Well, there you have it, Julia. And in case you're wondering, you can grow other things using all of these planting systems. Okay. Good to know. <laughs> Julie Watts in Oakland. Julie, thank you.